We created a couple of games, or maybe finished one and created another one, on the last episode. And here we have our newest game, Cruel Intent. And I thought before we publish it, let's do what we did last time and let's purchase a market analysis. So it's going to cost 80, 85, it's going to cost 500 bucks to do that. A good amount of content, so we actually are okay on that front. Um, good player for the market, 88% unique. Fun factor of 41, market average of 38. So it's a little better than, than the average. Um, only exploring 14% of the market, average 30%, offer more gameplay. Now, I'm not sure how to offer more gameplay. Um, they're estimating an 83% rating, which would actually be better than what we got on our last couple of games. And you might notice we got a little more information this time. That's because we already had a play test completed. I believe that's why, anyway, I, I should say that. Now, I'm not sure what I could do at this point to add more, more gameplay. I mean, obviously, we could do some different stuff somewhere, but I don't... I'm not sure what that really adds. Um, hello. Hello, you. I mean, we could do some trampolines and spikes and things, but I'm not sure if that is necessarily going to add a whole lot. So, you know what? We're just going to go ahead and take this game, which is a pretty good size. We're using a medium platform for it, of course. This is not on a small platform. And we're going to go ahead, and I think we're going to, to do this one just as it is. So let me go ahead and... Ah, oh, crud. I have to go through it again because I... I... Oops. I, I ended up kind of not really actually changing something, which means I now have to go through the torture of trying to beat my own game that kicked my butt last time. Oh, I was so close. I know how to do it now, which is the good thing, and so do you if you've paid attention at all to how I have struggled against this game. In fact, you might even know a better way to do it than I do. Um... Man, I cannot seem to control myself on those trampolines! I get all flaily! Oh! I was trying to... Nope! Wow, that was a quick death right there. <laughs> I was trying to do something a little different because it seemed to work. Nope. It seemed like it might work, I, I should say. Not like it seemed like it did work. Alright, we can do this. Okay, done and done. There we go. 8.2 seconds, so I'm going to call that good. Let's get out of here. Um, you know what? Here, I, I need the URL, so we'll copy that. And then I'm going to make a note of that. Cruel Intent, you have been copied. You will be in the description for this video. And let's go ahead and get out of here. So we are going to go to the vault. And let's bust open our account. We're going to publish Cruel Intent. Now, this game is going to cost a lot of money to publish. $2,000, so... I'm sure that's in part because of its size, and in part because of all of the... horizontal spikes that I used. I mean, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, so maybe it costs 200 bucks to... 250 bucks to publish a big game. We're gonna set the price at 999. That's right. We're going for broke here, and we, we might end up broke. I don't know. But we got an 83% review. Oh, crud, it only got 81%. Look at that. We got nine grand. And we got a bunch of new fans. So you know what? It all worked out. This is our best performing game again. In terms of rating, in terms of profit, in terms of new fans. Oh, man. All right, look at that. Make 10K with one game. We got a new achievement. I, yes, I like that. I like that. Number five on the top seller chart. Conversion rate is a little better, 22%. All right, that's good. Brought in $11,000. Well, 11,293. And then uh, once you take out all of those development costs, that still leaves $9,000 for us to play with. 98% fun. Boom, take that, everyone else. Content, 100%. Rating, eh, 81% is pretty good. Originality, 83%. New fans, 336. Um, hmm, hmm. Dova. I can't wait for the sequel. Fus... Ra... Hmm. Is it Fus Ra Do? Fus Ra Do, Fus Ra... I don't know, whatever. Fus Ra Dim, Fus Ra... Whatever to you, my friend Dova. Because, um, yes. I'm glad you cannot wait. Garbage! Garbage. Garbage. Die more. 9 out of 10. Um... Hmm. I'm going to say that's a good review. 
I'm going to say that's a good review. Let's go back and take a look and see what else is on the market. Man, that's pretty awesome. I'm I'm really excited by that. That's that's cool, man. That is good stuff. I am very happy to see that we have ourselves a successful game. So Cruel Intent and Lars Runner up there on the new release list. Horizontus, we've already done that one. Big Bad, Chicken Run, Catch Ride, Bounce Bash. We do have a new one, though. Single Signal by Chronic. They have 11,000 fans. That's pretty cool. I was looking at this earlier. I thought I'd go ahead and show you. When you click on the publisher or the developer, as it may be, you end up getting all of their games, which is pretty cool, and their number of fans. So obviously, we're a, we're a small time developer, although Chronic, how they went from zero fans to 11,500, they must have had a good Kickstarter. <laughs> Gennaro is rocking over here with 30,000 fans. That's pretty awesome. And then uh, let's see, Retro Ladies, 53,000. Wow, nice job, Retro Ladies. And then uh, AD, the current king right now, 511,000 fans. Wow. Well, let's check out Single Signal. Now, looking at this, there's quite a bit going on, we can see. And let's just go ahead and fire up a game. So what do we have going on here? Um, oh, I know what's going to happen to you. I do. Oh, I don't know how I feel about this. There's one block down there. All right, let's see what happens. Apparently, I'm going to jump on the cloud and fall off of it. I don't know. I don't know. I'm wondering why that block is there. Yeah, that's what I thought would happen, too. Everything has been freed. Oh. Well, that's interesting. Oh, crud. All right, so... Theoretically, this is designed to do that, right? That's what I thought. But then, you have to avoid that, and then, ah, that's why that's there, so you can bounce back that direction. Oh, come on. I'm getting a terrible time. I could have done much better. All right, we unlocked the blocks that we can um, basically change phase on. That's pretty cool. I like that. That gives us more stuff to play with. I'm, I'm, always, in, I'm always liking when we can get more stuff to play with. I think that's cool. That is good. That's, is that the current featured game? No, Big Bad is still the current featured game. Let's check out the best sellers list, just because I'm curious. Um, bummer. None of our games are on the best sellers list. That that stinks. They they might have been at one time, but they got bumped off. That's okay though. That's all right. Let's go back to the store because I think we might have one or two things that we should check out now. We have fourteen thousand dollars. Still cannot buy the background color. One of these days. One of these days. We can buy a couple more um, decorative tiles or that sort of thing. Sand tile. Curious if the sand tile... Well, I don't know. I'm just... I'm having some thoughts now. Curious if the sand tile, maybe if you can drop it somehow. Um, I don't know what we do with a beehive. Um... I kind of feel like well, I should buy it just, just be, just because. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to, but I'm curious. I totally admit I'm curious. Um, we're not going to add Matt or Annie just yet. We're we're going to wait a little while before we do that because I think what we would like to do instead is buy. Oh crud! That's going to be expensive, isn't it? Oh man! All right. Well, we can do this. We can buy the beacon. That leaves us with 4700 to play with. Now, we got to make sure that we have some money kicking around after to make sure we can publish. I mean, granted, I think we can publish without anything because the, the, the returns will come out of... Or the publishing cost will come out of the returns we get. But, oh, man. All right, well, how much is the helicopter? A million, huh? Um, and you have to buy a helicopter pad first. <laughs> uh, Notch probably has one. I wouldn't be surprised if he does, actually. I really would not be surprised at all. Not not in the slightest. So now we get to the point of where we have to decide what our new game is going to be. What's our new game going to be? Um, I kind of wanted to buy the sand, but I don't want to spend the money on it. Let's do dog drop. So we're going to do a dog drop game. 
And here's how we're going to do this. It's going to be a small game. Yes, it, it will be a small game. And we're going to do it just like this. Something along those lines is going to go right there. And then we'll do something like so. We'll just go ahead and extend that out. That'll be okay. Congratulations, that is now enclosed. Do you know what I'm going to do? You probably should. So we're going to put you there and you there and you there and you there. And then, um, actually here, you know what? Let's just do it the smart way. We'll just do that. Nope, you don't, you don't belong there because you're too expensive. So we're going to do that. And then uh, we're going to put something like... Something like that, maybe. Here, let's get rid of that and that because those don't need to be there. And then, uh, just for giggles, we can do something like that and that. And um, we need a we need a beacon somewhere, so we'll put that uh, right there. Oh, you fall down. All right. Well, good to know. Zoom. All right. Well. Oh wow. What do you mean danger? Apparently, I can't die. Let's go ahead and stop that because apparently I screwed that one up. Here, let, let's. Let's close that in on the bottom, just so that doesn't happen again. And I... Oh, you know what? Nope. Nope, nope, nope. I got it. Um, wrong one. Come back. I want that one and that one. Perfect. You only get one shot at this, so... Don't screw up. <laughs> oh... What is wrong with me? I, I don't know. There we go. 4.46 seconds. A nice simple game that requires you to have a little bit of timing. So let's just do a market analysis because I, I have a feeling this is not going to be enough. We're probably going to have to to do some more stuff. Lighting and yeah, consider challenge, changing dog. Ooh, it is overplayed. 100% unique to this market. Very unique. It's not very fun. So we're going to need to add some more excitement. Um, only exploring 15% of the game market average, 99%. Offer more gameplay, 60% rating. So this one's pretty garbage. This game is pretty garbage right now. Pretty, pretty garbage. We're gonna go ahead and we'll follow, we'll follow their advice, and we'll do, um, we'll do chicken drop instead, because we're not going to change how you win. That's that's not gonna change. What we might change is how you get there, and um. Hmm. I'm going to think about that one, because I have some ideas for how we might do that. But for right now, I like that just as is. Because it's totally ridiculous, and you only get one chance at it, which... I do like that. I like that you only get one chance. Gotta be perfect. <laughs> oh, it's so ridiculous. I love it. Yeah, that is cool, because if you fall down, at this point your game is done. You can't get up there. I needed to make sure and check that. It sure is. Even if you could get back up there, it wouldn't do you any good because, well, then look at that. You'd, you'd end up with a block right on top of the, the bouncy pad. So go me. Go me for making stupid games that are difficult and um, make you want to kill me because um, that's pretty bad. I, I like that. I like how bad that one is. That That's fun. But we're going to wrap it up right here and we will fix this game and make a better game and probably do another market analysis on the next one. So I'll catch you then. Thanks for watching. Ah, oh, I just got egged. See you later.